morning everyone and welcome back to a new vlog um today it's a little loud today you guys are gonna get to come along with me at school i'm actually on my way to school right now um i really only have one class today like one regular class wait and that one starts at 9 30 it's like 9 20 right now might be a little late but it's okay um and then i have a break and then i have an exam oh my god this is gonna be my first exam this semester and it's finance so it's a lot of numbers a lot of stuff that you kind of have to memorize and know so we'll see how that goes but i'm gonna like study during my break so i think it will be fine. Oh my god, I'm walking through a jungle. This is the path that I pretty much always take. I usually bike, so I'm usually on that side. But I'm walking today, so got a good little sidewalk with jungle right here. And I was gonna bike, but my, my guy really scared me. Um, I was gonna bike, but I got a new bike and I put it together myself and something's off with like, one, the brake, like the front brake is a little off, so that one doesn't really work. And then my gears, they don't really shift properly. I don't know if you guys can see me. Um, they don't shift properly, so I need to get that figured out, and then I can start biking again. I just finished up with class and the next one that is supposed to be right now is optional so I'm just not going to go to that one because I have an exam in like four and a half hours that I need to study for so I'm going to cram in some last minute studying and make like a little cheat sheet so that I can have that for my exam so I can hopefully pass it and Josephine is here also doing schoolwork and um, yeah we're probably gonna sit here for a little bit and make sure that I pass my exam because it's finance and it's a lot and I don't have all the notes so we're gonna try to figure all that out and hopefully make a really good cheat sheet so I can pass it yeah had to move because we were in the computer lab but they don't allow any food in there so we had to move and sit outside but it's okay it's kind of nice being outside it's the computer labs honestly get really really cold it feels good when you when it's hot out and you walk in there at first it feels really good but then after a while it's almost like you're cold like you're freezing so it feels kind of good being out here but we're only going to be here for like maybe 20 minutes and then josephine's going to go to class and then i need to go home take Kino out but I'm still doing my schoolwork I'm finishing up my cheat sheet um, and I'm kind of coming along uh, it's kind of come along pretty well I am kind of just writing down some equations that I'm gonna need um, for my exam so that I don't have to worry about figuring that out during the exam I just kind of just have them on there and um, yeah I'm Finishing up here, hopefully, this will help. Yeah, I'm be home for a little while. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, that feels good. Yo. <laughs> Hi, my love. I am going to be home for a little bit because, um, one, I got to take Kino out for a little potty break. And then, oh, and then, um, I'll just be at home studying and stuff. Look what was by my door when I just came home. It's a package from Sephora and we're gonna open it. First thing I bought was a face oil. This is the rose hip oil from the Inky List, vitamin C, which is also really good. So I have oil for the night. I have the vitamin C for the morning. I got this Rare Beauty Warm Wishes Effortless Bronzer Stick. One, my bronzer is like almost empty. And then two, I've been wanting to try like, not a liquid bronzer, but like a, a stick bronzer because I feel like it creates more of like a natural look. Ooh, this might be really cute actually. I got that and then I was literally like four cents away from free shipping. So I just got this like tinted lip balm from their own brand, Sephora's brand. So that's cute. Love getting packages. Love, love, love. For the people that don't go to a university or college, it's very expensive. <laughs> Not just like the tuition and all that, but it's very expensive when it comes to eating there, getting snacks, getting coffee, whatever you want to get. It's pretty expensive. So I figured instead of spending, I'm on my tippy toes by the way, Instead of spending a fortune on lunch at school, why not just go home and eat when my house is, or my apartment is literally 15 minutes away from school? So I think I have some frozen macaroni right there that I'm just going to warm up. And my favorite, we got Swedish meatballs. I warmed up the pasta and for some reason, it just did not smell right. So I did not want to eat that. So I'm only going to eat meatballs. And we don't have ketchup. <laughs> Maybe I should have spent $20 at school to eat. I finished my cheat sheet and saved it. Um, but I'm going to have to print it at school because the printer that I have at home doesn't have any ink in it. So... I think I'm just gonna, we're not gonna leave yet. I'm making coffee right now because we all know I need that. Um, but I was gonna say I'm gonna leave a little bit earlier than I thought just because I need to print it. So I'll leave in like 30 minutes. And I think I'll actually take my bike just so I can get there faster and I can go home faster afterwards. Um, yeah, even though my bike is a little weird, it works. Like I took it to work the other day and like it's fine it's just like it doesn't run super smoothly so um it'll be okay i think it'll be fine my bike lock isn't working i'm trying to figure it out but it's not working Like, I'm trying to put it in, but it's not like, it's not going in. Do we chance it? Do you think anyone's going to steal it? I'm just going to leave it. Okay, like that maybe. It kind of looks locked. We'll leave it like that. Uh -huh. Oh well. I'm back. I need to go to the computer lab again because I need to print my cheat sheet so that I can pass this exam. I just finished my exam and oh my god <laughs> it was a little bit more difficult than I thought but my notes definitely helped a little bit so I think I passed it at least I hope I passed it now I need to go check if my bike is still here and it looks like it is yay <sighs> guys I'm home oh I got so sweaty by here <laughs> that's pretty bad but I got home. By the way, there, um, hold on, let me try to put you guys on a good level. Okay, that's good. 
um, there's this guy in my finance class, the class I just had an exam in, and he, we have like a Discord chat with a whole uh, class basically, and his name is very, very Swedish, and I saw that uh, a little while ago, and then like I messaged him and I was like, hey, like are you Swedish, because your name sounds very Swedish, and he's like, yeah, I am, and I was like, oh, that's funny, I am too. Maybe I'll, like, recognize you in class. But I never really recognized him because, like, some people had masks on and, like, you know, I was like, no, I couldn't really figure it out. And then today, after the exam, this guy walked out before me. And then when I came out, he, uh, I saw in his backpack that he had a Sweden flag on his backpack. And I was like, nice flag. And then we just started talking a little bit. But it's kind of fun. Like, I... There's a pretty big group of Swedish slash Scandinavian students at Long Beach, and it's really fun. I feel like cold water is so underestimated. Like ice water. Ugh. Like it's so cold that it's almost hurting my throat. That's a good cold. Anyways, you guys. I think... That I'm going to sit because I have two assignments that are due tonight. So, I need to do those. I don't know how long it's going to take. I don't think it's going to take that long, honestly. It's literally just a little paper type of thing for one of my classes, my communications class. And then I have one class where we do, like, Excel files and, like, we do work in Excel for all of our assignments. And I need to finish that one. So I think I'm honestly going to like, I'm out of breath, so I need to start biking more. Um, get a boy! I am going to grab my computer, and I think I'm going to put on Bachelor in Paradise, because that started yesterday, or two days ago, whatever, and do some schoolwork. We decided to go to a coffee shop to do some schoolwork instead. Just to kind of get a little bit more productive. Uh, I at least tend to not be as productive at home. <clears throat> oh. Just because when you go to a coffee shop, you kind of just take your time uh, to go there, and then you're like, I might as well just go work because I'm here. So we're sitting here. I got my cappuccino. It's really cute. I've never tried this place before. It's actually really cute. Though. So we're sitting here doing schoolwork. I have a little bit more than I thought, but we'll be done with it soon, hopefully. So, cheers. So we're gonna go to like the Starbucks or the coffee bean, but they closed earlier. And this place closes at nine. So we have like an hour and a half instead of just like 30 minutes. So, that's kind of what went down here, but it's really cute. I thought it was going to be a little bit busy, but it's really not. So, I definitely recommend this place down on 2nd Street. If you want to go to a cute place and get good coffee and get some work done. No. Nah. 